This is an overview of the key features released in the new Origin 2018. We have several additions and improvements such as graphing, cell formula, and Unicode support. One key feature is the App Central dialog, which is a new dialog added for helping manage Origin apps. You can browse through available apps and install or update apps with a single click. Simply select the Add Apps icon and select the Download button to install the app into your Origin workspace. Cell Formula is a new capability where you can enter a formula within the data area of a worksheet, allowing you to calculate variables such as mean and standard deviation, as well as calculating the difference between two cells. The Cell Formula also supports cell ranges and can combine multiple functions into one cell. A formula can as well be assigned within the user-defined parameter row. After a formula is entered, the cells can be dragged in order to apply the formula to all columns within that row. This feature of dragging a cell horizontally or vertically can be applied within the data area. A new project file format has been added to allow for origin project files to be easily identified within Windows Explorer. Large or extra large icons will display the image of the last activated graph when the project was saved. As well, you can use the scroll bar in the preview panel to view all graphs within that project. Image pop-ups help view the image in a worksheet more easily. Use the cursor to ho hover over a sparkline cell and an image within the worksheet, or an embedded graph, in order to enlarge the graph and view as a pop-up image. Within the Origin Central dialog, you can now open Origin projects. Under Recent Files, the dialog will list the last file that was open and saved. If a project was closed before saving, the project will be listed under Unsaved Files, allowing you to recover the edited version. Other Origin di Central dialog improvements include using the search engine to quickly find graph samples. There are four new graphs in Origin 2018, bridge charts, 4D XYZ plot with cuts and boundary, double Y box plot, and color map line series with color scale legend. To learn more about these new graphs, use the sample projects that are provided within the Origin Central dialog. Another feature added to 2018 is the capability for customizing reference lines, which can be used to add the mean, standard deviation, and other statistical functions. Reference lines can, can as well be added by using expressions or equations based on axis scale values. Additional legend customization includes an interactive dialog to build a legend entry, customize symbols and or lines, symbol size and thickness, and additional literal text. Graph layers and objects can now be evenly distributed vertically or horizontally with equal spacing. Graph export area can be used to define a sub-area of a graph for exporting the graph or copying and pasting the graph to another application, such as Microsoft Word or PowerPoint. New hotkey controls have been added to Origin 2018. One example is the F key, which provides the capability to edit the light source direction on a 3D graph. More customization is provided for tick labels. For multi-word tick labels, simply use the wrap text and define by layer length or by number of characters. Unicode support has been added to the GUI such that you can directly type Unicode characters into the header rows. Batch reports can now include graph images. Hover over an image cell to view the graph as a larger size. Select any row and press the Open Book button in order to recreate individual book reports. A variety of new apps have been developed and can be installed onto Origin 2018. Some of these apps help with graphing and with managing files within Origin. We have several other key features added to Origin in this 2018 version. To find out more, please go to originlab.com 2018. Thank you.